I know that they, had, they were detained, they were charged for some offenses by immigration. They went to the court and they played guilty yesterday. They were fined a thousand plus five dollars cost of court. And today's date, um, Social Security is to lay charges on them for another matter relating to Social Security. Okay, um, are, I know or I'm told that Major Crimes is dealing with the case. Since there has been a history of immigration, of um, falsifying immigration documents, and it appears by the attestation of the Immigration Department that they have a fraudulent nationality certificate. Is Major Crimes investigating it as part of a wider ring of uh, immigration fraud? Yes, the police is doing a part of the investigation. The Immigration Department is dealing with that internally and also Social Security. It's the three agencies combined together working to see from where the certificate was obtained until the point they reached Social Security and the police is doing, dealing with the investigative matter in regards to the fraudulent document. Okay, now there is another person involved who is a translator. He's from Kamalota village, a Taiwanese Belizean, I understand. His name is... Um, Mr. Lin. Yes. He was detained along with Mr. Zeng. Both of them were charged, as I mentioned. Both of them went to the court and they pleaded guilty and they were fined the same amount of money. A thousand dollars plus five dollars cost of court. Okay, but Mr. Zeng won't be, won't face the soldiers. I understand he's been released. No, he is still pending in that investigation yet. Okay. And, and also an additional house search was conducted at Mr. Lin's residence where other copies of documents were found at his residence. So police is looking into that to see what other charges he can be levied against him.